to solve the challenging problem both sides divided by the second factor. So we get square root of x squared plus 1 plus x equals 1 over square root of y squared plus 1 plus y. Now we view the bottom as a plus b using the difference squares formula. Top and bottom times a minus b. So it would be square root y squared plus 1 minus y. Same thing for top. So square root of y squared plus 1 minus y. Now the bottom x is y squared plus 1 minus y squared 1. So we get square root of x squared plus 1 plus x equals square root of y squared plus 1 minus y. Move this term to the left side and this term to the right side. So we get x plus y equals square root of y squared plus 1 minus square root of x squared plus 1. Square both sides, so we get x squared plus 2xy plus y squared, the right side, y squared plus 1 minus 2ab, so 2 square root y squared plus 1 times x squared plus 1 plus x, uh, y, uh, uh, b squared, so x squared plus 1. Both sides subject x squared, subject y squared. So we get 2xy equals 1 plus 1, 2 minus 2, square root of x, uh, y squared plus 1, times x squared plus 1. Move this term to the left side and divide by 2. So we get xy minus 1 equals negative square root of y squared plus 1, times x squared plus 1. Square both sides again, so we get x squared y squared minus 2xy plus 1. The right side, y squared plus 1 times x squared plus 1. Expand the right side, so x squared y squared minus 2xy plus 1. The right side is x squared y squared plus x squared plus y squared plus 1. Cancel x squared y squared and 1. Right? Move this term to the right side. So we get 0 equals x squared plus 2xy plus y squared. It is actually a perfect square. 0 equals x plus y squared. Taking square for both sides, finally, we get the answer x plus y equals zero. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.